Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a really long time since I have uploaded, but I've been busy and there's been stuff happening and everything. So, um, yeah, I've just been, <laughs> I guess I've just been busy. Today I will be putting away some stuff oh wait ugh, that i've collected here um over this time period we have some postcards and some photo cards and other goodies very fun um i don't know i don't think i have i mean they should be like binders like organized maybe i didn't organize them so for this binder it's exo so i'm gonna see and just take out all of the exo cards and then we can get started all right i have them all here um it's not that many like if you compare it to the other stacks that i have but it's a few so let's get started so first we have some seasons great wait kai is last First we have some uh, Japanese album and season's greetings. So we're just gonna hop over uh, here. Okay, so uh, <laughs> I'm gonna explain here. I've gotten a bit lazy. Uh, so whenever I have a card coming, I just take it out and put one of the like these sleeves I'm gonna put them in, in here because, because I've gotten lazy and it's easier for me to see which cards I have coming. So let's just place... Uh, my cats are here, so if you hear them, um, I apologize. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> I just want to talk about how gorgeous um, this card is. Wait, can we talk about that? Thank you. No, I just... Um, actually was not super excited for his Japanese debut or whatever you could call it uh, yeah debut um but I actually really enjoyed like, all the songs I think my favorite one is addicted for sure that one's so good it's so good I saw it first on Kyungcon and it was so good and I really like the, what's it called? The choreo too. And here we have the little season's greetings card. It's a little thicker. It's like a news reporter thingy. I don't know, but it fits really well with all my other season's greetings. Um, right, so I've been selling off a little bit of my non-album cards because, yeah, because. <laughs> And so it's a little messy here. I'm not really sure. I think I'm just gonna keep it this way. I don't really know. And we have flow. Uh, okay, so now I have to think here. How big is this card? It's like it fits here. So, oh wait, it's the same size as this. So that's not good. <laughs> uh, I think season screenings. I'm gonna put behind the other season screenings. So let me just grab. Oh wait, no. Let me grab a pockets I'm gonna put season's greetings um go here oh it's perfect my cat is right here <laughs> okay uh oh no oh no hold on okay I think I can make it <laughs> there we go and then this the war card hmm i know i have maybe i don't oh wait mm. this little thing oh no my cat is climbing on the tripod go away uh, this card like like this one i think i'm gonna put these two together hmm God, I'm not sure where to put them. Maybe before temple. Like here. Let's see. Put these in two pockets. 
have prepared like all the pocket thingies like like some of them i have them here i hope it's enough okay and then this one this is one is like from sm town museum i don't know <laughs> anyway next we have kai and i have decided to collect him now because I, uh, I'm very incisive about who I'm going to collect and who I'm not going to collect. <laughs> so, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, and I have put these in before because I needed uh, this for Kai, so I just put the thing in too. And here I have, um, this is Super M for sure. I think this is the flipbook one because it doesn't have any text. And then these two, I'm just going to put them in here. Oh. I really like his solo. I'm so excited. He was actually the first EXO member that like caught my attention in my first bias. Uh, so I've always had like a soft spot for him. Uh, oh, and also before I used to make like this purple dots for the cards that I have coming. But as I said, I am lazy. Okay, let's see. Um, so this binder has really not changed that much yet. Oh no. Because I basically have been focusing more on like the groups I have in my other binder. So, oh, and I also have this one of these. Hmm. Hmm. I think this one coming, like from the first album. Yeah. I said I didn't do anything for that one yet, so. Oh no. no. I am so bad at this. Come on. <laughs> Alright, that was everything for this binder. Let's move on. Alright, so I tried my best to kind of put the tripod in place, so I hope it's good enough. Um, and I hope you really can see my legs. Okay, you can't. <laughs> so this binder is TXT and Stray Kids. So I think I'm just going to start with TXT because they're first and we have quite a lot here. So let me just, hello cat, <laughs> let me just take everything out and then we can start. All right, here I go. There's like this much and it's quite a lot. So let's just, let's just get into it. Um, let me see. Oops. Okay, so... First, I have this Yunjin, which is here. Mm. Let's see. It's gonna be fun. Let's put that in there. Yay! Okay. <laughs> okay, so since this is gonna be um, quite a long video, I have some questions I'm gonna answer. Um, And so let's start. So first question is, do you plan on? So first question is, do you plan on changing some layouts in your binder, and which layout is your favorite? So, um, my favorite layout, maybe these TXT because they all fit so well. <laughs> and for as for changing the layouts, um, yes. I definitely have been thinking about it because, um, like, I'm never happy really with the TXT layouts because there's five members and it's really, like, confusing which, like, which way should I have it? Should I have it, like, 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 you know, like, two, 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 or just, like, across like I have now? And it's just very confusing and I never, sometimes I just change it up, um, by myself you know to see how it looks and then i'm never happy with it so i always go back to like the way it used to be and i don't know that just kind of yeah i guess that's that's the hardest part and i also once tried to change up my beckham layout and i did not like i didn't like that at all so i went back to um the regular like the one I have now so yes I'm very indecisive when it comes to those kind of things um, 
um, yeah, I think about that a lot, a lot, because sometimes I get bored too, and yeah, and then I just like to change it up. And most, like when I'm bored with the layout and also just bored in general, like oh, I have nothing to do, let's just have some fun with the binder. Let me, yeah. Um, so yeah. So here I have Blue Hour, all photo cards. I'm so excited. Hold on, let me just see the box. Pink, blue, pink. Let's do blue first. And while I do this, I'm gonna reply to one another question. Ah, uh, how do you feel about soloists or groups doing a million similar photo cards? Example, one ho. Mm. Honestly, I don't blame like the artist. It's obviously the company being money hungry. Um, and so I, I don't blame obviously the artist. It's not their fault. It's the company being greedy. And I think we see that a lot, especially like with SM. They don't really do like the whole million photo cards thing. What they do is a million album versions. Like, it's really not necessary, but also for Wano, um, I don't really collect him or anything, listen to him or like keep up, but I know that, didn't he have like 18 photo cards? Oh wait, no, maybe that was back here. Wait, didn't he have like a lot anyway? Maybe 18, maybe it was 18, maybe it was like two of these. Anyway, he had a, like a lot, a lot, like a lot. And like the album, I think was four versions. What was it four or three? Uh, like, are you serious right now? And they all were like selfies with the like similar backgrounds and everything. No, no, it's just, I don't know. I don't feel like it makes any sense. Really? Uh, maybe for a group, fine. Okay, I kind of get it, kind of, and not really. But like a soloist having like 50 different cards, it makes no sense. I think it's stupid. Um, but with that said, oh wait, oh. if Becky never did it, I would buy it. I would, I would, and I would spend money on that because I am a loser. Um, yeah, so, but it's kind of the same now with Becky's Japanese album. There's like six versions. Five, six, six versions. Six versions. Like, come on. Six versions. Like, no one needs that. What? Like, it makes their. Ugh, I don't know. Maybe that's the reason I wasn't that excited for it. I don't know. It just, for me, it makes no sense. It's obviously company being greedy and, you know, capitalism, basically. Okay, hold on. Um. I'm so happy to finally be finished with Blue Hour. I'm only missing one single card to be done with all of TXT, and that's Bumgyu's port from Eternity. And I have that one coming in the mail, but it's been coming for like four months now. Um, four months? Four weeks. So I guess we'll see what happens with that. Um, let's see. Also, um, for the I. The cards I've already like put them right there so they look cute and everything because um, they are transparent which I don't really like I don't like that but um, I put like white paper behind it so you can see more yeah let's see I did purple here because I like it more it's colorful and then we have this and then we have these I'll go in there, Hyunkai, we have Taehyun, oh, I actually wanted to wait with filming this until that purple bumgyu comes in, but I don't know if that's ever gonna, <laughs> like, no, I don't know, I have so many cards, I wanted to put them away now, so I just decided to do it, because I wanted to do one of those, like, oh, you know, finish my TXT collection with me or whatever, but, like, no. Uh, okay, so this... Oh, wait, yeah. The purple cards. Uh, 
so since I'm done with all the album cards, I have been thinking about collecting an album. But at the same time, that's so annoying and expensive. <laughs> so I said I decided to collect Kai instead. And I also am not finished with my Pangchan collection, so I think that's more priority right now. Uh, like this, then we have season's greetings from oh wait, from this year, which we have here. Let's put that in here. I really like these photos too. They all look so good. Let's start with Kihin and Kai because he's at the bottom. Um, I really like these Seals Greetings cards. I think they are super adorable. Um, I also want to add another thing with my TFC collection is that I um, put Yeonjin as the first card because he is the oldest. And Subin as second card. But I know some people do like Subin first because he's the leader. But I've tried that and I didn't like it. I don't know, I guess I've just been doing this way since Star, and it's kind of hard to like change it now. <laughs> uh, so we'll just do it this way. Let's see, Yanjini, like this, and then we have these. Also, I have this little sticker from their uh, Seas Greetings, and I'm just gonna put it here. Hello. And the last one, there we go. I think that's everything for TXT too. Let me see, uh, white stick, na 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 na. Yeah, next is Pangchan. And that is like literally the only thing left here. And some cards. So let's kind of just get into it, I guess. And yeah. Oh my gosh, hold on. Now I'm gonna have to think like where everything's gonna go. Uh, childhood photo. Okay, let me I have two more questions here, so let me just answer them. So hold on, who goes first? Uh who? Yeah. Uh how do you feel about collecting pre-order benefits and do you think it has become too much? <sighs> hmm. I know a lot of people have a lot of opinions about this and honestly I do too because I am not oh no upside down I am not a big like pre-order benefits like fan I guess I mean I do have some of them just because sometimes you can find them at a good price or something like you know along those lines so yeah um but yes i do think that it has become kind of too much because i know a lot of companies uh not like their companies but like k-town for you and stuff like that they do pre-order benefits and they go for a lot like a lot of money and it kind of i don't know first it used to be just like a fun thing oh like oh uh i got an extra card because i pre-ordered or whatever but now I feel like it's become kind of stressful and uh, I don't know. Sometimes there's so many of them too. Uh, I know Stray Kids for like Seasons Greetings. Yeah, they had like six pre-order benefit Polaroids and like, what is the reason? Six Polaroids? Come on now. Like, you don't really need that many. Come on. Um, so I feel like that's kind of... I don't know. I feel like it has become too much. And some of the, even the photo card lists that exist, like... Hold on. Hold on. Uh, like, templates and stuff. They have all the pre-order benefits, too. And if you look at them, there's so many, like there's a lot, there's almost like there's more than regular photo cards. And I feel like that makes zero sense. 
and for me personally i don't collect on uh, i don't collect pre-order benefits like religiously like i do with um regular photo cards but it's, if i happen to stumble upon um like a cool pre-order benefit on my instagram or whatever like this i will buy it if it's a good price you know because oh no wait <laughs> because I like it, you know? Like, I like having extra cards, especially if I like them. Like, I like Bang Chan with red hair, so I got the pre-order card. Like, it's not a big deal, like, that, but it's... Hold on. Mm. Let's see. I hate putting them in the- like, why is it so hard to put them up here? Like, it makes no sense. <laughs> And then we have the cards with the backs. Oh, wait, there's a little something in here. Maybe we just... <clears throat> mm -mm. Yeah, yeah. Also, I feel frustrated it's really hard to find like their Japanese cards too. Um, I feel like it's super hard to learn. <sighs> Watch me struggle. Oh. There we go. Wait, for here we have Seasons Greetings. So you have this pure card. We have three Polaroids, one Lenti, and this. So this is not going in here. I think I'm going to put the Polaroids at the bottom. Yeah. Chance about the right. We have this little pre order benefit. <laughs> Just like we were talking about. Lenti is in the. I really like this lenticular too. I don't know if you can see. I really like it. It's from the Go Live Unlock. I'm not sure what it is. I think maybe it's the concert. I don't know. There we go. And then the season greetings card. There we go. It's always like this. And Polaroids. These are also from the Unlock Go Live in Life. It's really cute. Um, hold on, let me see. I want to. I, I always have like something in mind, like I want to put them in like a certain order or whatever. Hold on. Uh, there we go. And then this. Okay, so I have one last question, so let's do that while I'll put away the postcards. And that is when did you start your collection? And I get this question a lot. Um, my collection started, I think, like 2019. I'm not exactly sure um, about like the exact month or date or whatever, but that's when I got like my first album, beginning of 2019. Uh, but I don't think I started collecting like seriously at that time i think it took me a while to start being like really serious about it and mm, i don't really remember for real <laughs> it's been a while now though um, mm -mm -mm. is this going to fit in this one guy no ah stupid Let's just put this in here. Um, but yeah, like around 2019, beginning of 2019, maybe like mid 2019, I maybe I would say mid 2019. Yeah, something like that. <sighs> yeah, and then this big. Put that in here. These are also pre-order benefits. Uh for the seal greetings. I like it, it's really cute. Um, I'm gonna put this one first. Maybe it doesn't matter that much. <laughs> okay, cool. That, and then this one on top. Mm -hmm. And here I have this and this. 
then it has this little deal picture here. This is basically for the cards I'm not collecting. Um, I have deal here because he's going off to someone and I have no one to keep him. I just want to keep him safe. So yeah, uh, that was everything I believe. Oh no. So yeah. <sighs> Let's go back. Perfect. That was everything. Um, thank you so much for watching and I hope to be back with another video soon. Um, but for now, uh, thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Bye.